in this lecture we will be working with data frame columns so let's talk about the objectives in this lecture we will understand how to add a new column in a data frame we will understand how to convert the data type of existing column we will be changing value of an existing column we will be renaming a column and we will understand how to drop a column from a data frame so let's start okay so this is my spark shell and i'm going to read customers data which is in csv format so i'll be saying because we have header present in the data so i'm going to say header true dot csv and then i'll be providing the complete path and my path is user spark data set retail db and customers okay so this is my data frame we can see the data using show and just give me five records so guys we are able to read the customer csv data now let's start from dropping a column so there are some columns for example customer email customer password which doesn't contain a valid data so i'm going to drop them so let's understand how to drop a column from a data frame customer data frame is equal to customer data frame dot drop we can use dot drop api and then here we can provide comma separated strings so we can say customer email and the second column is customer password and i also want to drop another column which is customer street so these are the three columns that i want to drop okay we are done let's see the data frame customer data frame dot show and give me five records so guys we can see that now in this new data frame we don't have three columns customer email customer password and customer street so this is how we can drop columns from a data frame now let's understand how to add a new column in a data frame so first of all we will be adding a new column with a, a literal value for example i'm going to clear the screen now customer df is equal to customer df dot with column we can use with column api the first argument is the name of the column so i want to add a new column with the name country and i want to add a literal value here so i'll be passing let and i want to add country like usa now we are done let's see the data frame customer df dot show and give me five records we should be able to see a new column now as we can see we have a new column country with the value usa so this is how we can add a new column with a literal value now let's understand how to add a new column which is derived from the existing columns so we have two columns here customer first name and customer last name i want to add a new column customer name with the values from customer first name and customer last name separated by space and then i'll be dropping customer first name and customer last name column so let's do that so i can say customer data frame is equal to customer data frame dot with column and inside with column we can say i want to add a new column which is customer name and the value is now i want to concat the values from the two columns so i'll be saying concat ws we can use this function concat ws concat with separator and the first argument is the separator itself my separator is space the second thing is we have to provide the column name so i'll be saying my column is customer f name and the second column is customer l name and we are done so let's see the data now
dot show give me five records so guys we can see that we have added a new column customer name in the data frame and the value is derived from the existing columns customer underscore f name and customer underscore l name now i am going to drop these two columns so i'll be saying customer df dot drop and providing the names and providing the names like customer f name L name. Now let's see the data frame. Dot show. See, so we have added a new column, customer underscore name, which is basically a derived column. Its value was derived from the column customer underscore F name and customer underscore L name, and we have dropped the other two columns, F name and L name. So this is how we can add a new column which is derived from some existing columns of data frame now let's understand how to change the data type of an existing column so for that first of all we will do a print schema customer data frame dot print schema let's see the schema now we can see here that customer zip code is of type string it should be integer so what we will be doing is we will be changing the data type of an existing column let's see how can we do that customer df is equal to customer df dot with column and in with column we will be providing the uh, column name so my column name is customer zip code this is my column and what i want to do is i want to change the type so what i'll be saying is i'll be saying column call and inside call i'll be providing the name of the column which is customer zip code and i'll be saying dot cast cast this column into integer type so let's specify integer here okay we are done so let's see the schema again customer df dot print schema So, if you see the schema again, we can clearly see that customer zip code is now an integer column. Now, let's understand how to change the value of an existing column. Before that, let's see our data frame. So we have customer df dot show. Let's see the data and we are interested in five records so this is my data frame now what i'm going to do is we have this column country which contains the data usa so i'll be changing this data existing data to us so how to do, do that how to change the value of an existing column we can say customer df is equal to customer df dot with column and we can provide the first thing is we will be providing the column name and the second thing is we will be saying call country dot substring 0 to 2 that is we just want to take the first two characters of the country and we are done let's see the data again customer df dot show and just pro providing five as an argument so we want to see five records so we can clearly see here that the data has been changed so this is how we can change the value of an existing column now let's understand how to rename a column so in the same data frame we can see that we have a pattern of you know uh, column names for example we are starting column names with customer underscore state so we will be changing the country column name to customer underscore country let's see how can we do that okay so we will be saying customer df is equal to customer df dot with column renamed this is the api that we are going to use now and 
the first value is the existing column name. So we have country and the next is the column that we want to rename the new value. So that is customer underscore country. Okay, and we are done. So let's see the data again. Customer DF dot show and give me top five records. Now from this output, we can see that the column has been renamed to customer underscore country. Okay. So guys, in this lecture, we have learned how to drop a column from a Spark data frame. We have learned how to add a new column with a literal value and also how, out how to add a new column which is derived from the existing columns. Now we know how to change the data type of an existing column and change the value of an existing column also. We can also rename a column name using with column renamed. Thank you.